how to record a sound and then turn it into MIDI. Wicked quick. So here we go. I've got a backing track here. See? It's an acoustic guitar just doing a little run. There we go. So now let's go back. I've got the click track on. I've got my uh, vocal uh, track here armed here uh, with the mic. I'm just using uh, SM58 right now. And now we're going to just record some... I'm just going to do some stupid singing over top. It sounds really bad. <clears throat> get the point so there we go so now i've just done that now you can hear it back and mute this sounds pretty bad let's take that off okay so that's good let's go in here and quickly melodyne it so what we can do is right click it and then we can edit with metal dyne that'll pop up and populate and then we just go over here and you go select all. So they're all selected. Go in here and use a little bit of pitch correct all together. 100% pitch drift, 100%. And then of course, you can go in there and edit every single one individually. Uh, but that's just to make sure that it's exactly in so that the MIDI can figure it out. So now we've gone and done that. And so now let's hear it back quickly. <laughs> Okay, so that's great. Now, over here, I've got a violin that I've queued up and loaded in. I just used uh, the Play Engine Hollywood Violins. Somewhere here, Hollywood Strings or something. Solo violin, that's what it was. So then we go, and um, I'll keep the reverb on. You could do all these afterwards. Anyway, so now all I want to do is I want to take this here track, and I want to make it into a MIDI track. And here we go. Wicka -wicka. Hoo -hoo. Boom. No. No way. Can't be that easy. Can't be. There's no way. Guess what? Way. Have a listen. Oop, I should probably unmute this. What? No way. So there it is. I detect a little flub, little error in there, which I can correct any time just by simply going in here and moving any of these around. There we go, like this. See? And all I did was double click. So that's a MIDI track here. This is just a backing audio track that I just recorded. And this is the vocal track that I melodyned. And that's in Studio 1.4. Wicked quick. Ha. This is a uh, 4.6. Sorry, Studio One 4.6. I did it wicked quick, ha. and there we go. What? That's impossible, and so amazing that you can do that. Thank you very much, and that was a wicked quick video. Goodbye.